We finally got the first motion impressions from the Canon C700. DP Russell Carpenter shot a nice mini documentary, The Calling, with this camera and it looks fantastic. But is this camera the new Hollywood favorite workhorse? Maybe not with this sensor. It is the same sensor that is working in the Canon C300 Mark II. But Canon announced a new sensor, a global shutter sensor, with an impressive dynamic range of 15 stops. The sensor will come out in uh, early 2017 with the Canon C700 and it will cost 2000 euros more, 2000 dollars more and will also have a better low light performance. And this was always the problem of global shutter sensors. The low light performance and the dynamic range. If Canon keep their promises, this will be a strong competitor for RE and RED cameras. The C700 global shutter version will be only available with the L mount, but the Canon professional service told me that you can send in your camera to get an EF mount. The global shutter version of that camera won't feature the dual pixel out of focus, which other cameras or sensors actually have. So what does that mean for the rest of the EOS Cinema line? We may get a Canon C100 Mark III with a global shutter, but for sure with less specs and a weaker codec, but those are just my thoughts on it. There is a lot of motion on the sensor market right now. Canon also announced that they will produce sensors for other manufacturers now. The Canon sensors are very popular for the color signs, so Maybe we'll see a black magic camera with the Canon sensor. Time will tell. Until next time.